Hello, my name is Andrew Stern. I'm one of the pastors at New City and also executive director of Restore St. Louis. I want to encourage you today in the hope of the resurrection. It's October, but Easter is coming. And you can be assured that if you have put your faith and trust in Jesus Christ, if you've called out to him for salvation, if you've confessed your sins to him and called out for your need of his saving work, you can be assured that you'll be resurrected. What is the resurrection? Well, uh, that original resurrection was of Jesus the Christ, the son of the living God. He died on the cross for the forgiveness of our sins. Uh, he died uh, to take our punishment and it was placed on him. And on the third day, he rose again from the dead. And in, in a unique way, uh, his resurrected body was different. It was imperishable. It was not going to uh, rot and destroy like his original body that was corrupted by sin and, and evil. And in that same way, when we put our faith and trust in Christ, our perishable bodies will be resurrected with the imperishable body. And I can't tell you uh, exactly what that all looks like, but what I can encourage you with is that in that resurrected body, uh, it will no longer um, uh, decay like our present bodies do. And that is good news. That's also good news for those we know who've gone before us in death. In Christ, they will be resurrected with a body that is imperishable. And I would encourage you to read 1 Thessalonians 4.14 and also 1 Corinthians 15 that reflect on these things. Paul says very bluntly in 1 Corinthians 15 that if there's no resurrection, there's actually no hope. We can eat, drink, for tomorrow we die. Uh, we're most to be pitied if we don't believe in the resurrection. But Paul assures us, God assures us, and Jesus in his resurrected body assures us that this promise, this hope is sure. And so I wanna encourage you with that today. Let's pray. Father in heaven, thank you that you have given us this promise that the perishable will be raised imperishable. And Lord, uh, that you promise to resurrect us. Although we die, we will actually live forever. Lord, we pray, uh, would you help us uh, to put our hope and trust in you for this promise and also for those who've gone before us, for brothers and sisters, aunts, uncles, moms, dads, grandparents, uh, many others, Lord Jesus, uh, in your body, Lord. We look forward to the day when you will raise us imperishable. Lord, we thank you for this promise. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. May his face shine upon you and give you peace.